All right, what's up, guys? This has been an incredibly fun project with Alpha Airsoft. Let's start from beginning to um, end. First of all, I wanted to do this for myself to say I've done it. It's been, like I said, it's been fun. This did take a while. I also wanted to make a video on this because uh, when I'm working with customers, we got custom projects. It comes down to, hey, you know, can I do this color? What's possible? And, you know, we'll look for pictures. The problem is some of those pictures, I would say a majority of them sometimes, are edited. And I was like, you know, that's that's an issue for me. And then, you know, I was doing this secretly on the side for fun. And I was like, shit, you know, let's just make a video. I don't edit my videos. There's no filter or whatever. I don't have the best lighting, but I feel like this will help people see the colors. Now, the only thing I'm going to put out there is a disclaimer before we actually start and going over. You guys have to remember, there's a lot of... Um, I don't know how to say the word, but it's uh, if I show you this color and I say this is this is okay, this is the lighter red, but what you see on here you might not get because you know they, they were telling me sometimes temperature affects the the color or you know who puts it in, you know basically we're you know we're humans we make mistakes or it's not mistakes but different times different temperatures and. And that's why you'll see me all rage about it. You know, like I'll have six different tints of gold because they were all produced at different times. So with that being said, if you they if they if you want one color, let's say you want lime green, and you know you want six or seven parts, try to get those lime green parts all in one batch. That is the most important uh, advice I can give you. And that's yeah actually that's that's the one and only advice I can tell you if you try to get the color get the batch done all at once that will uh, reduce the effect that you have different you know shades of lime green don't if you have like a really dark lime green and, and a you know certain lime green that matches your one maybe you know I don't they would never do it but I'm telling you guys maybe that one was done at a different time that's what I'm trying to tell you guys so, so get it done in one batch now I know you guys didn't wonder What's the price? These were all 20 each for the colors. Expensive, I know. If you hear the hate or whatever, uh, don't bother. I, I, I'm just, I'm really tired of like uh, YouTube uh, guys who are just stupid and say the stupid shit. I just, I won't put up with it. Just, you know, it's my money. My channel is for creativity. To have fun to show you guys what you can do. Your high kappa. If you can't afford this, that's okay. But don't come in here and start bullshit. All right. Now this is what I was I'm excited for this the rainbow and also excited for this this is expensive as well but excellent job all right this is deep this is deep seeing green you know CNC I don't know if you guys can see but I'm able to push it into it even with the letters this is starting at 35 for deep and then they have like a lighter a lighter engraving if you don't want to spend 35 that's I think it's 25 uh, don't quote me on the prices, you know, prices can change or whatever, but this is at the time. And this this was done about, I started on this with them about three months ago. I really want to apologize to the, guy at the, uh, the guys at the factory. I know I probably dr drove them, you know, nuts. Because this is, isn't, you know, a normal order. You, usually you, you try to get a big group of batch of one color. And I, I, I was probably the, the jerk who... Uh, made them do of one of each batch so I apologize but thank you guys it came out so so good looking I think everyone on Instagram Facebook agrees we all uh, we're all happy about this but yeah alright I got the price and everything let's go over the colors I'm gonna try my best I don't remember the colors offhand because this was three months ago but let's start with the reds came out beautiful one is lighter okay well, I think Obviously, I feel like this is a dark red, and this is a lighter red. I don't know the specific colors, but they have a color list when you talk to them. They'll say, you know, what colors you want. I literally just told them, give me every damn color you got, and I tried to get as many. Oh, by the way, guys, these are on Pro and these are Pro and Max. They are aluminum, so these, you know, it's type 2 uh, anodized. So you can't do it with TMX. You can't, and then plus these are just... These Pro and Max are nice. I love them. If you're gonna buy Pro and Max, get the War Game versions. The War Game versions are with the channel. Do not get the Epic version. I love Pro Ins, but these are a pain in the ass, and I, you know, I've had to bore these out just a little bit bigger to work with all, you know, more BBs. So get the War Game version. Uh, Alpha Airsoft does have them. I think I didn't have 
these. I didn't have three of the war game uh, standard size. Okay. So we got the reds out of the way. Let's get the reds out of the way. Uh, this one definitely is black. I wanted to get black because they don't have a stock pro one in black. And I just, you know, I wanted to just say, I, you know, hey, I have it. <laughs> this one I'm a bit confused by. I thought this was titanium. And honestly, I, I'm not sure if it's titanium. Could I actually bought the new slides to review? Which is going to be coming up really soon. And they're awesome, man. I just, they're such a cool design. I think this is titanium or... No, shoot, this is dark gray. All right, shoot, okay, whatever. I don't know what the titanium is. But I could have sworn I had a titanium, and this is it's definitely different. I don't know if you guys can see. This is much darker, and this is a lighter color. And then we got gold. Oh, so good looking. All right, we got gold and champagne. I think, I'm pretty sure this is champagne gold. Really nice, it's just... You don't, I haven't seen this color. I was like, what the hell? Where did this color come from? I, I haven't seen anyone's build. I, I would say even like 90% of us are in this color range and not in this color. So it's like, it's cool. It's, it's, I, I'm doing this video to show you guys, you know, what's up. And you know, there's no editing in here. You see, I'm hoping the camera represents as best as it can. All right, we got a dark green. I, I feel like it's a dark green. This is, it's darker than my Hulk green. But that's what I was telling you guys about, different times, different scenarios. And then we got, I'm sure this is lime green. I was talking to a friend who just got his done in lime green and it came out beautiful. We got orange. Once again, I was like, man, barely anyone does project with orange. Orange, it, orange is a hard color. I feel like it's a hard color to, uh, to work with, but it's definitely doable. Very awesome. Like one day I'm gonna do it. It's gonna I'm gonna make an all 100% aluminum gun. That's one of my, I've had that goals for a long time, but just didn't complete it yet. All right, and then we got this is pink, or I, I know they had a rose something. That might be rose red, and this might be pink. I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that. Purple came out excellent. Ah, so excited for this. I just gotta figure out what to do with the base plates. I had some more projects in the background for this. I'm not done with these, but uh, this is just a, the beginning for me right now. And then the blues, Shiva, Shiva is happy, that's for sure. Blue, and then this is like, what, a teal turquoise, guys? Uh, I'll check the list. But once I, like I said, they have a list. When you talk to me, you know, you say, I wanna anodize stuff. Don't forget, they, you know, they can anodize slides for you. Anything that's pretty much aluminum, 60, 61, uh, you can pretty much anodize. Now let me show you what it looks like. Really, uh, yeah. I don't know, super excited. And then I gotta figure out the base plate scenario. Cause see, I gotta put all these back. These are all the parts. So if you're gonna do this project, but you know, you're inspired or whatever, make sure you do, you know, your due diligence and take apart the whole pro in. And this, all you have to do is to send them the shell. Just send them the shell. And then, you know, you don't have to do this logo. So it'd be like, you know, 20, 20 a pop. And it's just, it's adding the small details that add up. Gold, what do we have here? Look at that, very nice. And then another killer that's gonna be awesome is if you got a mag like this, they have, you know, uh, Armor's work has the holes in them. You, I mean, you could even get a stock team grip and make out a slot now. This is. This is what it's all about. You know, I want, I've want. i been trying to do a project where I'm trying to put an LED into the grip. It's you know, some crazy stuff, but it's fun. Let's see, what would look good in here? I guess it's gold. You can see the gold through there. So like they did an Iron Man build. An Iron Man build would be cool. But I don't want to do an Iron Man build. It's already been done. This is from my Tiki, but I haven't finished it yet. Pink gold. Okay, awesome. See, if I had a certain color that was a favorite for the problem is I love so many colors, I would probably get like five of, if I had to choose one, maybe it'd be five blue ones because for my Shiva, that was like one of my first, well not my first, but love that guy. Oh, we got to show these two. This is what a stock pro one looks like, all right? I, I didn't touch this, okay, obviously besides this part, but you know, this is what it looks like out of the box. And then, you know, you can see all these color, you know, colors you can do. 
and this is like semi-polished it's not mirror finish but you can mirror finish the um, pro end so don't don't forget about mirror finishing stuff but I, just, I basically what I tried to do for this project was show you everything possible with pro ends you can do this with TM guys obviously you can't anodize but you can be creative you can you know sand these down you can mirror finish them you don't have to the chrome ones are already pretty nice but talking about like this one you can strip this paint you can sand it um, you can spray paint it so you don't you don't have to do this round I'm just trying to show you guys multiple options all right I don't think there's anything I, I, I missed not gonna talk about my other project because that's just you know that's other stuff and oh be careful you, you, don't buy this and expect that it's gonna be purple forever or and have no streaks it will start showing streaks down the road because the mags do get abused a lot okay it's just it's just part of it um, if I guess my word of advice be if you're like really trying to protect them go buy you know one of these guys because these are like one of the fattest mags put into your grip make sure it's you know it's fitted and it doesn't hit into sides and you know work on that first but you're gonna see worm marks after a while and what else if you're buying Pruins get the war game ones and nice job Alpha Airsoft really happy with how this came out I have to figure out what I'm gonna do with the base boys I got a couple ideas that are one of one or two of them are crazy I was thinking about doing some light uh, cuts to lighten this the, the Okay, I'm rambling. I'm done. All right, my bad, guys. I'll see you around. Take it easy. Ha, <laughs> ha.